restaurant group is coming together with the Butterfly Pavilion to give people fresher food. Today, the two announced a new partnership. The staff at the pavilion will manage a beehive for edible beets. And then that harvested honey will be served to its customers. Jamie Larry joins us live in Denver tonight. Jamie, Edible Beats owns a few restaurants people may recognize. They do. This is L5. It is the newest of the Edible Beats restaurants. You may recognize their very first one, though. It's also now in DIA. It is Root Down. This is a huge partnership, but we found out today why it is so much more than just about the honey. I'm pumping the smoker a little bit, so we want a nice, white, thick smoke coming out of this thing. The smoke actually calms these honeybees. These are very calm bees. This is one of about 50 community hives Mario Padilla manages for the Butterfly Pavilion. I wanted to be a zookeeper when I grew up, and I kind of am a zookeeper now because the Butterfly Pavilion is a zoo for small animals without backbones. He is the head beekeeper, and for the last two years, he's been facilitating partnerships between the community, the Butterfly Pavilion, and honeybees. I could go to your business and I could keep hives for you. Um, it's really vital that they keep hives here because of all the food that they're growing. This hive belongs to the pavilion's newest and largest partnership. Edible Beets recently jumped on board. It owns six restaurants across Denver. This is their private urban garden, where their new hive is quite busy. So this is before honey. This is not quite ripened enough to honey. Do you want to put your finger in there? Yeah. Just take a taste of it. Oh, no way. That is so cool, good. Right? Yeah. This hive will produce about 50 pounds of honey. While it is delicious, it's not really about the honey. So I think for the most part, we're really focusing on the pollination services that these animals are going to be able to bring to the various fruits and vegetables that are growing here. Honeybees are pollinators, helping the restaurant garden thrive. It's great for us to have that really local partnership that's focused on um, f local foods. As it just so happens, it is National Pollinator Week. There are events going on all week long at the Denver Butterfly Pavilion, so you can learn about the importance of bees and this partnership. But meanwhile, let's not forget, at the end of the day, you'll soon be able to enjoy some fresh local honey and take in these views. Live in Denver, Jamie Leary covering Colorado First. Not bad, Jamie. Thank you.